think uh, I think we're moving up quicker than previous waves. Uh, and actually, if you if you look, for example, Oracle, I think it took them 15, 20 years until they they really became a mature company. Uh, VMware, which started about uh, what 12, 13 years ago, it took them about maybe eight years uh, to to be a big company, a uh, mature company, and. I'm hoping we're going to do it in five, so yeah. a couple more years. Highly accelerated. Yes, but yeah, we see, I mean, I'm, I'm, I've been surprised by the growth. I have been. I, I've been so told, warned that? about enterprise software and, and um, that it takes long for adoption uh, to take place. But, but the I've consumerization trend is really changing yes. that. I mean, it seems to be that yeah, yeah, the enterprise is always last. Why the shorter cycle? I think the shorter cycle is coming from uh, uh, having the, 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 the right solution for the right problem at the right time. I think that's a big part of it. So luck definitely is a big part of this. Now in terms of how, why this is changing uh, compared to uh, um, uh, a couple of dec decades ago, why the adoption is changing uh, compared to a couple of decades ago, I, uh, I think that's coming just because of how quickly the technology itself, the underlying hardware, is evolving. So right now the fact that you can buy a single server and it has eight cores to 16 cores, has 12 hard disks, two terabytes each, is, is something that's just pushing the, 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 the limits of what you can do with the existing systems, and yeah. hence making it more likely for new systems to disrupt them.